Good evening, and welcome back to the stream. Tonight we will be playing Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries with the Merc Tech mod. Um, this will be a fresh start of the main campaign story. Um, if you were with me last Tuesday, we did sort of start this again. However, there were some fairly major technical difficulties. And I thought since we were only the one play session in, let's try it again. Take it from the top with the mic working. So, we'll get into it very quickly. We're going for Merc Tech level, Iron Man. That, I think, is the only one I turned off because that does make things ex that extra difficult bit. Um, but everything else we are keeping as is. So, let's jump straight into it. So I will be letting you guys hear the, uh, I'm at the rendezvous point, but our contact isn't here. You see anyone, son? The salvage crates at the last checkpoint were empty. Something's up if they're missing payments. This is Commander Mason of Major Campbell. Make a note. Looks like someone is going to need a lesson in paying their bills on time. That's odd. What the hell? It's not good, is it? <laughs> how good this opening fight is <laughs> it's nicely done okay. except that's a mech with jump jets <laughs> We're coming. 
just know it. Sounds like Borderlands. Um, songs that. No. Please pardon the puppy. Commander, sorry to wake you, but our Citra has changed. Head to the bridge as soon as possible. Thank you, thank you. Let's get to the bridge. Aha! Commander, good to see you up. We haven't really had a mm -hmm. chance to speak since your father was killed. I'm not much for sentimentality, but I worked with your father for a long time. He was a good man. Hell, he sacrificed his life to save ours. I don't know what's going to happen next, but whatever it is, I'd like to be part of it. I'd like to stay on as your ops commander. That is, if you'll have me. You kidding me? Your family, Rihanna. Or as close as I have now. Besides, I'm gonna need you. Yes. I suspect you will. About our Citrep, it's not great news. Those bastards that came after us are in the process of setting up a blockade of the system. Which means we're going to be trapped here with a tightening noose around our necks unless we do something about it. Who are these guys? Another mercenary outfit by the looks of it. I don't know more than that at the moment. And these coordinates they were looking for? Not a clue, but we're going to find out. First things first, we need transport out of the system. That means a jump ship. I sent out a transmission right after the attack through the HPG. The message was for a longtime client of your father's and an old friend of mine. Name is Spears. He has powerful connections. I'm hoping he can help us out. Until I hear back from him, there's nothing we can do except lay low. In the meantime, Fahad wants to see you down in the hangar. The Centurion needs repairs and he wants to discuss them with you. I'll let you know when I hear back from Spears. Copy that. Cool. There we go. And I apologize if you're hearing me breathing into the mic just then. I just adjusted it ever so slightly. Yeah. Let's go talk to Fahad. Get told about how badly damaged our Centurion is. And we won't be riding in it. We'll be riding in... Hey mate, figured you'd want an update on the Centurion. Took a bloody beating back there, so fair warning, it's gonna be a while before she's operational again. Means you're gonna have to get comfortable with the light mech over in Bay One for now. She's a good girl, won't let you down, you treat her right. I'll do my best. Yeah, heard that before. Anyways, you know the drill, access the repair terminal here. Once you're done, I'll get started on the work, eh? Hey. Okay. That bad boy repaired. 37 days. 45 days for an object. So, you, what do you have? I mean, four medium lasers. And that's it. Do I have any missiles I can throw in you? That's all I can. Nope, I. Two hundred engine. Okie doke. Back upstairs to Rihanna. This is one of the problems with the game. Is they station these two away from each other. 
thought could have been up here because I can access all those battle mechanics right here. Hey, Commander. I've received a transmission from Spears in response to my request for help. Take a listen. Liana, I received your message. I'm sorry to hear about Nikolai. He was a good man and an even better pilot. He'll be sorely missed. I assume his son will be taking over the operation. Nikolai was always bragging about the boy's skills. Well, I hope he was right. I've begun working on a plan to get you safe passage out of the system. But it's going to take a little time. I expect you already know by now that whoever attacked you has set up a blockade to prevent your escape. It's a large system, though, so we can use that to our advantage. As Jump soon ship. as you Ooh. receive this, I want you to proceed to the outermost planet in the system. It's a little more than a hunk of ice with a few leftover mining operations on it. There's an abandoned power station there. Now, I've got it on good authority that local raiders are using it as a secret cache for their ill-gotten goods. I know you can use supplies and materials for your repairs, and I expect you'll find what you need at that location. I've attached the exact coordinates to this message. Once I have a proper plan in place, I'll contact you again. For now, be safe. All right, time to suit up, Commander. I've already input the coordinates. All I need is for you to sign off and get us there. Understood. Ah, and I've done it again. I forgot to change the Twitch title. First thought. Okay. Uh, Mercs. Mercs as a to edit out. That changes and updates on Twitch. I'm playing Mac Warrior 5, not Mac Warrior Online. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Okay. Um, right. Access home screen to view. Transmission except transfer get rid of that. Did you do up there? System map smash and grab. Yep, we know how that works. I vaguely remember it. Let's uh, try and make more money. So welcome if you joined it says that it should actually say Mac Warrior 5 now. Um playing a fresh start of the campaign on Iron Man mode on the Merc Tech difficulty setting. About to drop for our first mission. Raiders is derelict, Commander. 
but you can bet his perimeter defenses won't be. My guess, the Raiders will have turrets stationed around the perimeter. If that's the case, it means they must have a generator close by. Find and destroy that generator before assaulting the plant, and you'll have a much easier time of it. Got it. Thanks. Heads up, Commander. I'm detecting enemy units up ahead. Could be a radio patrol. Lasers. There we go. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Yeah, that will cool off a little bit. Help. Come on, use your jump jets to jump over the rock. Chunk of ice blocking the path down to the generator. Use your jump jets to get over it. Perfect. With the generator blown, the turret should be disabled now. Target acquired. I don't want to be messing around with them. Alright. Must admit, it does feel quite different to MWO. I mean, this response quite quick because it's a light. But. He's out. Oh. You're a zombie mech, so. Good down to find some trees. Zombie mech, so we don't do arm weapons on this one. All torso mounted. Out of here before that tank decides wants to join in. Oh, that's a long way down, isn't it? Oof. Harsh landing. But we're in. Nearly there, Commander. Approach the hidden object to pick it up. Generators. At least those generators are pretty easy. To okay, pop. got it. Keep looking. All right, that 
should do it. Go ahead and meet me at the exfiltration point. If you see anything worth blowing up on your way out, say a weapons depot or something, I want objects. Understood. Oof, they shot me in the face. How very dare they. Also through my armor too. That's not good. Let's get out of here. Cells moving nice and quick. It's kind of locust speeds out of this thing. down now the next one is always a fun one to try and do because the next one is a bit more involved a lot more going on i will take one two three all of those that allows some skills up yeah i will claim the extra money Let's go talk to Fahad. Sup? Hey, boss mate. That was quite the haul you brought back. Gonna make the repairs a bit easier now. But don't go getting stars in your eyes or nothing. I'm overworked as it is, and this shit needs a lot of loving, eh? So your centurion is still gonna take plenty of time to fix. But yeah, like I said, nice job out there. Your old man will be proud. Now if there's nothing else, gonna get back at it, all right? Lot of work to do. Story of my life. You called me over to talk to you. I was just gonna let you crack on. While I'm here. work with those raiders commander while you were planet side i got word from spears about the plan he's put in place for us take a listen okay, okay. Liana, commander good news i think i can get you safely past the blockade with the aid of a local mining company to make everything work i'm gonna have to find you guys a recycled mercenary identification number a new identity essentially nick's cavaliers for all intents and purposes no longer exists that's sad. I'll match that number to a new name of your choosing once the time comes. So think about what you want to call yourselves. We're good. While I arrange that, you're going to have to do a little work for the mining company in exchange for their cooperation. Things go well. They've agreed to hire you to transport some precious cargo out of the system aboard an inbound jump ship. Using the new mercenary ID and with a legitimate contract in hand, you should have no problem slipping through the blockade. I've attached the particulars to this message. I'll be in touch once you've completed the mission. Good luck. I already reviewed the information Spears sent. The mission is a straight-up protect and defend op. Seems these raiders have been harassing the mining company, among others. Stealing from them, extorting them, killing innocent civilians when their demands weren't met. 
I've uploaded the pertinent details into the mission briefing, so I won't repeat them here. You're good to launch any time, Commander. Roger that. I'll see you on the other side. This is going to be like solar size. Oh, that is very light. A little creepy for this out there. Oh, and yes, I am running the mod that gives you the it's explorable dropship. So there's all kinds of stuff you can go look at. Head Bay. Bridge access. Matched it. Yeah, not too badly. Not too bad. <laughs> All right, view transmission. It's imminent threat. Mining company settlement is vulnerable to radar attack commander, so we've got to protect. I'll drop you in at a safe distance. What's on the ground? Head there and defend. Should be a simple in and out mission, but no plan survives first contact with the enemy. As the saying goes, so be prepared for whatever comes. Good luck. Yeah. More money. The weather's really kicking up, Commander. Your visibility will be limited. Full spec jav. He didn't quit it. He's managed to keep some of my armor this time. Tanks that you can shake a stick at with air support. I uh, don't think there are any mechs. Is a fairly tough mission. You gotta keep the settlement intact. The tanks are all gonna be driving through it. And especially with this Merc Tech setting, they are tough. Air support coming in. Yeah, if you can kind of wedge underneath the turret, that's kind of a bit of a weaker spot for them.
Oh, running hot. Let's get some movement in. Speed is life. We're in a light mech. These tanks over here. Ah, nuts. They're going very gentle on me in these helicopters. Five feet holes. Let's use their proper name, shall we? Don't have a cooldown flash. Oof. That hurt. Oh my gracious. Heat is way up there. That works too. The mech doesn't really like that though. Where is this helicopter? There he is. Running, 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 running. Oh, my stuff is shimming, it means I've had a. Oh, there's the. Sensor blocker thing up here, isn't it? Brianna, my sensors are getting worse. There they are. The jamming device the raider set up is at the top of this pass, Commander. You're going to have to manage as best you can until you're able to take it out. Target acquired. Surprise! Oof. Target really? Acquired. 
Let's see out of that one. That's not good. damage i think it's like 75 percent damage and this is what they do 100 percent. they hit as hard as you do and all the fun little things like when you stomp on an enemy tank and it blows up yeah that hurts your legs yeah so let's try this again I also have gotten kind of used to stomping around in a marauder and having lots of armor and being able to face tank a lot of damage. So, jumping back into a light mech is painful. Painful. Yeah. There's the settlement up ahead, Commander. Looks like the Raiders have already begun their attack. Get in there and protect those civilians. On my way. Please help us. The Raiders are attacking our settlement. There are women and children here. Ow. Rihanna, something's interfering with my sensors. I think the Raiders have set up some sort of giant helicopter auto I'll see if I can locate it. Let's go around this side instead of having to hop over all those buildings there. I'm just gonna hop the rock. Give me a bit of speed. Let's try this again without getting murderized. There, good hits. Hit and run, hit and run. Much better. I guess it's just getting warmed up in the last one.
I've been that close as auto cannons going off. Think, yeah. Ride that red line. Oop. Trying to use my maneuverability a bit. Heat sinks. That's never good. A lot quicker getting through those, but still not confident the amount of armor I've got left. And I probably could cut along that road. Saved a few seconds. Knowing my luck, I'd also fall into the middle of this uh, town and kill four people. Two hundred K. Oh, Chavin's kind of quick. Brianna, my sensors are getting worse. Best reason to have jump jets in our tech. They are vectored, so they do actually affect your speed. Doing better. I've blown through my CT. Get rid of this guy. It's slower now because I want to try and save my armor. He's using cover. I want to come on airstrikes. But no. We can spare you any airstrikes. Okay, let's start clearing these buggers out, and I know somewhere along the way 
They're going to get some air support, which is going to include some pretty tough VTOLs. But they do have a weakness. You can shoot their engines out. There's some already damaged. We need your help. The Raiders are trying to destroy our facility. It's all we have. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Ow. Not actually what I meant to do, but turn you, bugger. You need to eliminate the Raider threat. That's one of the things with the, the gyro stuff is if you start running through buildings or the mechs, your mech becomes destabilized. And it's a lot harder to steer that. Oof. Yeah, chop it all the way down. Target acquired. Target destroyed. How did you name Roach? I'm doing this the very first time. Pink light. Guys are where? Ah, silly arms. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Spark. Then we'll go after another one. Yeah, you see you target one of its engines and it will go down. I feel so weak with these puny little tier one lasers. It's distance. Too much distance. But at least let me get a chance to get a bead on him. That's better.
Well, I got that one better than I did the last time I've tried it. I actually still had some armor left. Oh, we've become unknown. Ooh, and a good bit of salvage. Sort of. Uh, let us take a couple of SRMs. And a whirlwind AC5. Oh. Yeah, that's slammed pretty hard. Go through it. Outstanding job. Those raiders were intent on shutting down the entire mining operation. But that mobile jamming tower almost put a spanner in the works. Luckily it did thanks to you. There's a lot of people down there owe you their lives to that commander. As for what happens now, Spears has been in touch. It seems we have one more mission to execute before the mining company will sign off the transport contract. We need that contract as cover to get past the blockade, so we don't have much choice but to do as they ask. Come see me when you've cleaned up, and I'll give you the full rundown. Cool. Let's fix my mech, because we gonna need him. Uh, Alright, so happy for that. Hit it, edit, it, edit. It. And again, it spawns us in down here. Not pretty. Commander, it turns out the bastards who attacked us and who have set up the blockade are a mercenary outfit by the name of Black Inferno. Unfortunately, that's about all we know at the moment. Spears and I will try to dig up more information if we can. The time will come when we can extract some proper vengeance, but right now we have more pressing concerns. Inferno forces are closing in on our location. That good. means we only have a small window in which to fulfill our obligations to the mining company and haul ass out of here. The company wants us to take down the Raiders for good by destroying their base of operations. Once that's done, they'll arrange passage for us aboard the inbound jump ship. I've detailed the mission briefing, and it's waiting for your sign-off. You're free to launch whenever you're ready, Commander. Roger that. Sweet. Let's go have a look. Oh! Hey, boss man from Mort Reiner says the next mission's gonna be a bit of a doozy. Good thing I've got a century of fit as a fill ready to go, eh? She's got plenty of firepower, especially compared to the javelin. In case you want to upgrade, I thought you should know. You're welcome, by the way. Happy to be a service. Anything I can do to help get us off this bleeding ice cube fight. You know what I mean? Alright, that's it. Talk to you later. Decades ago, this planet was the epicenter of the mining gold rush. Of course, it wasn't gold the miners were after, but rhodium. Rhodium. It was boom, then bust for most of the companies, which means there was a lot of abandoned infrastructure left behind. One of these mining locations is where the raiders are currently holed up. You can expect the larger enemy presence that we saw at the power plant. You will need to eliminate all of them and destroy as much infrastructure as possible. Our employers want these raiders put out of business for good, so give them hell. Wheat. Oh, I got three points to work with. Let's go for one of each. I think there are mechs here, so we can get better salvage. Which gives us replacement parts that we buy replacement parts. Jav. So you're not ready, Centurion. You're not ready. You're not ready. Put you in the queue. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna put the Centurion in. 
This will be ready in two days. They're actually pilot. <laughs> Okay, got our Centurion, which is a, a fairly decent back, actually. I quite enjoyed the Centurion during these early times. I hope there is another mech we can go get pretty soon, which using my knowledge of the game. My part of this mech, my old man died. What you may notice is the lock-on tone is gone. That was something they added to this recently. If weapons need a lock-on, they'll get it. The lock on just happens. You don't get have to press and wait for the, the lock kind of just happens. Took some internal damage, didn't like that much. looking we okay we'll be okay
Some of those hit. Stuck in here. Is this the actual job to do is destroy this base. Cans are actually really good for blowing these up. But what else is really good is it? A few tons of mech. Blowing up. Excellent work, Commander. Now get to the extraction zone. Roger that. One beaten up Centurion later. Now we managed to do this. Uh, of course, there's contact on the way out, isn't there? That's not good. Mistakes were made. Looks like these raiders somehow got their hands on the spider mech. It's fast but lightly armored. Avoid letting it get behind you. Um, 
not gonna core it, but that spider is a slippery one. What it lacks in offensive capabilities, it makes up for with speed and agility. A deadly combination if it gets into your blind spots. This one seems to have pre-existing damage on his right leg. If you're having trouble hitting the critical areas, try focusing fire there instead. You may be able to wipe out his mobility advantage. Nicely yeah, I just there. wiped it out. Get to the extraction point, and I'll pick you up. Oh, you bugger. They were literally there trying to wait for me. Go on, you shoot it down, Rihanna. <laughs> Just wait for me to come out of that cover. Okay. Yeah, I was not expecting to get the mech out of that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I will take all of those. Sweet. Did some leveling up. Nice. Total kills. 19 kills. One back. That spider mech might be small, but it's also fast. Excellent work taking it out. Thanks to you, the raider forces have been all but eliminated, and their infrastructure destroyed. Best of all, I just heard back from Spears. Mining company couldn't be happy with our efforts, and have expedited the transport contract aboard the inbound jump ship. We're about to be given a second life, Commander. Here, take it easy on me max, yeah? Hey there, Gov. Oh yeah, we finally got a name for these bastards who've been chasing us down. Black Bloody Inferno, eh? Right? Well, that's a lot of bollocks, isn't it? You know what a Black Inferno is? It's bloody smoke, mate. All right then. Nice chat. Gonna get back to work now. You keep calling me over for a chat and get mad at me when we have a chat. I think we have a little bit of time. We want to get back to the deck because we need to talk to Riri. Here. Hi, Commander. Thanks to your Hi. efforts, the mining company have kept their word and booked us transport on a jump ship. Spears has also obtained a new mercenary ID number. Sweet. So, all we need to do now is choose a new name for our merc outfits, and we're good to go. I'll leave that up to you. Once you've registered the new name, come back and see me. Will do. I have just the right idea. Care of a certain sleepy puppy. Head to your office. I say my office is back here. But where is it taking me for that? I'm curious. What is back here? Oh, it's the other side of that wall. Let's see. Oh, the term. Nice. These hot rods. There we go. 
has a nice custom made icon. Designed by my amazingly talented wife. I would share you her online stuff, but okay, she's never on the Everything is set for our departure. The transport contract with the mining company is a false flag Spears and I set up with their cooperation. The mining company has legally hired us to transport cargo for them. But in reality, there is no cargo. Just a destination and some very convincing paperwork. So, where are we headed? We've been asked by Spears to help him out of a jam. I think we owe him. I agree. What's he need us to do? Spears works for Interstellar Expeditions, one of the largest archaeological collectives in the Inner Sphere. They do archaeological digs and conduct research into abandoned Star League era facilities in the pursuit of lost technology from before the succession wars. Mm. One of the expedition's dig sites has come under attack. A rogue mercenary group is intent on pillaging a Star League supply depot that IE uncovered on Brooklyn Prime. We're going in to help protect the site. Spears will provide more detailed information on what exactly we're facing once we arrive. For now, I've uploaded the coordinates into the nav system. Before we can launch, you need to sign off on the op and get us to the system. Roger that. Okay. Quick time check. It is quarter to ten. I think this... Sorry, quarter to twelve. I think this is a great place for us to stop for the night. So, thank you very much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. This has been a better start to the new campaign. And we are into the missions properly so if you want to continue on following the story of howie's hot rods we will be back on tuesday next week doing the same thing again uh if you want to continue watching my channel for the other days i'm on i am stream another three days a week or f four days a week total tuesdays wednesdays fridays and saturdays tuesdays being Continuation of Harry Hot Rods and the other three dates playing MechWarrior Online. So look out for me, hit that sub hit that follow button, get notified when I go live. Uh, come hang out, have a chat, enjoy some stompy robot action. Until next time, stay safe and see you soon. Good night.